his ears bite off. Hey, hey, hey. I am the man who can just look at the woman and she gets pregnant. You should leave issues of the generals to the generals. You want another rap? Yeah, Susan! <laughs> <laughs> Are our heroes. See how this hero is enjoying herself regardless of the weight. Mama Wangi! Thank you! Thank you, our heroes. But the children we hear before have become a nuisance in Makerere University. Strike! After strike, and now their lecturers are also meeting to plan their own strike. I keep wondering, what is the cause of these strikes? Lack of communication is the one which are bringing strikes in Makere. Other causes, ma'am? Two, some of you seated here, you have failed to implement our policies. What are these policies they have failed to implement, madam? Even the accountants you seated here, the financial managers, you let us down. Do you know you are the people who even who blocked our community here? You accountants. Is there an accountant? If you cannot balance a, 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 an accounting equation as an accountant, why are you there? Anyway? So the accountants are not doing their job as expected? That today when they had there's going to be some meeting, there's a very small bone. We are not dogs. Let's now turn to Afande Samo Mala. What is your take? It makes me to attempt to think that there are some subversive tendencies to discredit the government. This is my personal thinking. Move over, Bwano Mala. Let's involve your boss, Afande Karekaihura, in this matter. You know the general is a man of all seasons. In fact, I have always wondered where he drives the energy. The other day I, was in a, I met a surgeon in Nairobi University, in Nairobi Hospital. And he was amazed how my system is young. Indeed, you really look young, Afande. He actually gave me that, that I should re remove eight years. And this is serious from my calendar age because my system is very young. <laughs> you, you may laugh, but this is serious. It's, it's a fact. It's a fact. Whether you like it or not, that's your business. It is okay, Afande. Oh, should I say young man? Yes. We are young. And that's why for me, I, I, feel, I, I feel proud when you, when, I, when you call me a comrade. Not Musei. <laughs> Although we used to call the president in the bush, we used to call him Musei when he was actually in his 30s. That was wrong then. But now we can call him Musei because he's very old. Bakadi. Actually, that's what you're reading here. That's what this person saying. How can you talk about a man like the president? You say that he's an old man. Again, you must, you must be sick. You must be sick in your head. Ah, oh, have you now started campaigning for the president? We are not in a rare. We are not in a rare. We are in an intellectual discourse. Yeah, this is an intellectual discourse. But it seems you are looking for votes. Be scientific. Not emotional. It's not about votes. It's about reality. For you. What is the reality here, Fande? Some people urge that the police should be neutral in matters political. If the rest of you don't value him, oh, we value him very much. All right. But here is another man the police can work with. A man who is very close to youth but has not made his intention is clear. He is busy making his six pack. I wish you well. Agnes Nandutu, point blank.